Hey, this is another fluff reading. This time I'm doing Death of a World, which details what a Tyranid Hive fleet does in, I guess, five phases. This is interesting because the data slate add-ons to the codexes are going to come in three phases. Vanguard, um then eating and then digesting where they will then give specialized broods for each phase of a tyranny inv invasion um, so let's find out what those phases are death of a world phase one invasion when a high fleet locates a suitable prey world it descends to the planet and disgorges a swarm of creatures into its ecosystem. Hordes of Tyranid vanguard warrior organisms make planetfall and churn across the world's surface, driven by the impulse to feed. The skies turn red as Tyranid spores choke the atmosphere. They then blacken as clouds of winged horrors dive from above. Soon, the prey world is seething with Tyranid creatures. Phase 2. Predation. As the swarms flood across the landscape, slaughtering the planet's inhabitants like cattle, strange alien structures begin to grow on the surface, which start poisoning the world's ecosystems. The Tyranids respond to threats with overwhelming numbers, expending lives by the millions to ensure all opposition is removed. If this fails, the High Fleet creates fresh new waves of Tyranids, which are specifically adapted to overcome any defenses that remain. Phase 3. Consumption Once a prey world's defenders have been defeated, writhing tides of feeder organisms are unleashed to cover the planet, consuming every scrap of flesh, every blade of vegetation, and every drop of moisture. Nothing is left to waste, especially not the corpses littering the battlefields of the prey world. Whether these are the bodies of slain defenders or the remains of fallen tyranids, all are consumed so that its biomatter may be recycled and the high fleet replenished. Phase 4. Assimilation. Having gorged themselves, the Tyranid feeder organisms return to large digestion pools where they both they and the matter, biomatter they devoured, are dissolved into a rich biological gruel that is funneled up through the vast capillary towers and absorbed by the Tyranids' orbiting bioships. When the culling is complete, and every shred of biomatter is assimilated, the Tyranids move on in search of fresh feeding grounds, leaving a scoured, lifeless wasteland behind. Oh, <clears throat> and that is the joy of a Tyranid invasion. We do not just beat our enemies. We consume them and turn them into more Tyranids. How cool is that? More fluff coming soon. Bye.